21% of the air is made up of oxygen, and this is how much we need to breathe. But what happens if you reduce the amount? Can we still stay alive? Well, I went to a place just outside Cambridge where they've reduced the amount of oxygen in their rooms there from 21% down to 15%. And they say that things just can't burn in this environment. Well, let's see what happens. Can I have a fire? Yes. Can I set uh, fire to your newspaper? I've, I've got a newspaper here, and you try to light my newspaper. Okay. All right. Let's see if it works. So shall I use, shall I use a lighter or the... Uh, well, let's try the lighter use, first use of all. Use the lighter. I'll try yeah. the lighter yeah. first of all. Okay. Oh, empty? I don't think it's a very try, good one. Try mine, if yours is empty. This is, this is a new one, is it? <laughs> okay. Okay, doesn't matches. work. Matches. Matches, okay. Ah, this is better. Okay, one, oh, okay, try again. Okay. Of course, the matches are still lighting because they have their own oxygen built in here. And that's what's allowing them to strike. But there's not enough oxygen to allow your newspaper or the match to actually burn. You're it's, right. It's only the match head here Absolutely with its oxygen correct. there. The, uh -huh. the newspaper could not burn by itself. Impossible. And of course, we can breathe fine in here. It doesn't affect us. It doesn't affect us at all. We could live in here forever. Very impressive. We've come outside to try a slightly larger scale version of the lighter. The lighter couldn't start a fire in the room because it didn't bring any oxygen with it and there wasn't enough oxygen in the room itself. So this should, this is petrol, I've soaked this uh, torch here in petrol, it should light nice and easily. Yes, look at that. So this is burning rather well. The question is, will this go out in the room? Well, let's find out. and the fire has instantly gone out. There really just isn't enough oxygen in this room to allow this, my, my torch here, to carry on burning. But there is enough for me to carry on living, so that's pretty good and I'm happy.